Welcome to the news. Our first add-on this month is Automatic Email Obfuscator, which is a free add-on by Jero. This has an interesting history. It was created in response to a forum thread for an update status on a version 8 PHP 7 add-on, originally by Manio. This was no longer maintained, but it's MIT on GitHub. So Jero picked it up, updated version 9, PHP 8, current best practice, and released it for the marketplace. And the source is on GitHub for anyone wanting to update further. If we have a look at the original add-on, there's this screenshot explaining what it does. It scrambles up email addresses as they're output by the server, and then some JavaScript on the page unscrambles them. And the concept is that email harvesting bots just see the scrambled message and don't harvest anything, but humans get to see the uh, actual email and can use it. Next, we have donations by DE Webmakers. This is $75 in the marketplace and it's currently version eight only. There's a front end block to collect donations from visitors. Then there's a back end page that tracks what donations have been made. And uh, also you can send a thank you email to say thank you for your donation. And then behind the scenes, it integrates with PayPal for payment processing. And you can configure things like the email and uh, what PayPal account it attaches to. And you can also use PayPal's test mode while you're setting it up. That's it from me. So over to Noor for the second half of this month's news. Thank you, John. And hello, Concrete CMS community. So today I'll start with a simple little package. Page counter by a developer for Concrete Pie. Uh, very simply, it comes with a block, you drop it on a page, and it counts visits. So it offers a, a few useful options, like starting from a specific number or resetting the counter. The purpose of this block is not statistical accuracy, it's a, a quick way to display visit numbers to other visitors, but it does that very efficiently. Uh, it's not Concrete D9 ready yet. Uh, and it's uh, $20 in the marketplace. My uh, second package is a big one. It's a form reform by John DeFish. This, this is probably the most flexible form package you can imagine. First, it's built on top of concrete blocks system. So each and every field in your form is a block. You need an input type, it's a block. You want a text box or a text area, it's a block. You The submit button, a honeypot, they're all blocks. So you build your form like you're adding blocks to your page. So when it comes to designing your form, the sky is the limit. There is absolutely no problem if you know how to template a block, you can template your form. Uh, if for whatever reason you want to add a content block or an image block or any other kind of block in the middle of your form where you can. Second, it's all built on top of pipelines. So you have full control over how the data is handled, over what actions are taking place when submitting the form and in what order. Most form systems have a very rigid submission pipeline, but form reform doesn't. For instance, you can choose to save the data any way you want, in a database, in a session, in a CSV file, both. You can uh, decide to use Ajax or not. You can decide to send the data by email, multiple emails, any way you want. Uh, you can analyze the data, validate it, manipulate it, save it any way, in any order you want. Uh, you can also show and hide inputs depending on different validation patterns that you define. You want to only show an input if another input has a specific value. You can do that. And the best, you can have a different pipeline for each form or the same one for all the forms. So it's very easy to use and very, very, very powerful. And finally, it is extendable. So you can create your own input blocks, uh, your own submission handlers, and you know you can do anything you want. Uh, so I know it sounds like you need to be a developer to make the most of it, but actually you don't, because this package already comes with so many input types and handlers, probably more than you'll ever need. And I can only imagine the most specific edge cases uh, where you would need to develop anything 
but it's good to know you can. So obviously this is not a package for your simple contact forms, but for more demanding forms, you'd be hard pressed to find anything with this level of flexibility. So it is Concrete V9 and PHP 8 ready. It's been battle tested on a few websites and it's priced at $70. Uh, thank you very much for your time and take care. See you next time. Bye.